Now again. Please don't let that happen again. Yeah, whatever, ma'am. Sure. <laughs> Be happy. That's more than what we are worth anyway. So you looking at Katakwa? Happy 80th birthday to your pants. <laughs> and congratulations to your shoes for being the last shoes standing. two weeks now again. Listen, I understand that you said about your mother and all, but you yeah, need to get your priorities straight it. before it's too late. I'll do so today, ma'am. I'm also very concerned and need to know what's wrong with her. Thank you so much. Okay. Ah, it's now on the matter. Not today, please, Lerato. When's now? Huh? When? Look at you. That's the lama footy call, man. You really look like a big now. No jokes. Next time you crave a pop, try licking your thigh. Oh, look at that. She can't reach her thigh because of all that belly. <laughs> it's funny how you're still here, and yet nobody likes you. Not even your own mother loved you enough. And you think those ladies at that orphanage of yours love you? Well, they are just doing their job. I'm gonna strike. Oh, that happened. Mr. Fanny would like to see you in the principal's office. They were from Don Glen Roger. Hello, Lerat. Super fans. <sighs> okay, just please keep it short, straight and simple. Well, before I start, let me tell you the truth about everything. The girl that you called a pig the other day. Are you going to listen to some Zimba? I'm going to say The boy he pushed the other day is being abused by his father. His face is like that because of all those bruises and cuts. The girl you made fun of in class hanged herself this morning. 
Funega ikondi le indobana yonke indo yenzayo no itetayo ingane futhe libi komnye umtu. 1, 2, 3 My world fell on me. Lost everything I could ever think of. She left me with nothing but photos. I kept listening to mom's favorite songs as months passed by. Began to have visions of all the good times we had. Lost concentration in everything. I felt like it was all my fault. I must take a blame for who I am today. A nobody with nobody. I led many souls to roots I'd never walk. Always pretended to be the perfect soul, but my selfish ways led a good soul into the ground. As I watched her falling from a distance with blood falling aside, I had not known my harsh words and tantrums would go out of hand and beyond. Zimkita took her life just like that. Now I have something to blame myself for, and there is no better way to say it. I am sorry. In life, you may know everyone's name, but you will never know their story.